Welcome to your channel, where we explore the power of geospatial technology. In this video, we'll build an interactive land cover dashboard using Google Earth Engine. You'll be able to select a country, view Modi's land cover data from 2001 to 2023, and generate real-time pie charts to visualize land use changes over time. Let's get started. First, we set up the core configuration. A list of target years. A default year for display. Modi's class names for land cover types. And the color palette that matches each class. This is essential for consistent rendering and analysis. Next, we add three key user interface panels using UI panel. A chart panel to display pie charts. A legend panel for the land cover class guide. And a credits panel for background info or authorship. Then we build a top left control panel with a drop down for country selection, another for year selection, and a button to generate the chart. When a user selects a country, we filter the country from a global dataset, store its geometry, and center the map. Then we loop through all selected years and load the corresponding Modi's image using the MCD12Q1 collection, clipped to the country geometry. Each year becomes a layer with a consistent palette, and only the default year is visible initially. Now, let's visualize the land cover using a pie chart. When the button is clicked, we use reduce region with a frequency histogram reducer to count each pixel class. We assume each pixel is 500 meters by 500 meters, or 250,000 square meters. We then convert the result into a feature collection and build a donut-style pie chart using UI, chart.feature.byfeature. This gives us a clear picture of how land is distributed in any country for a selected year. No map is complete without a legend. We build it dynamically with color boxes and labels for each land cover class. The legend updates only once per country load, keeping the interface clean. Let's test our app. We'll select Ethiopia, choose the year 2020, and hit Generate. Here's our pie chart. Looks like croplands, shrublands, and savannas dominate the landscape. We can switch years like 2005 or 2023 and instantly see how land cover has changed. And
That's how you build a powerful, interactive land cover visualization app using Google Earth Engine. If you enjoyed this, please like the video, share it with geo friends, and comment with the country you're curious about. Subscribe for more Earth Engine tutorials every week. Thanks for watching.